everyone. I'm just um, delighted to have this experience and I'm surprised also that uh, the details in which AP government is paying attention to bring the leaders for tomorrow, let it be education, let it be their food, let it be their hygiene, let it be a good purified water. I think there is hardly any thing which is left to make them a good human being, to make them uh, prepared for the better tomorrow. So I definitely uh, want these kind of exercises or this example to be, you know, implied by the other states because they have set an uh, exceptional example of uh, well thought of uh, complete strategy to bring education at definitely the next level. So my heartiest congratulations to the AP government and uh, this uh, this is something which is completely out of the box and uh, the the services the uh, you know the books the introduction of the dictionary the uh, session especially on teufel all all this is not the normal thinking it is well prepared well planned each and every department every person is involved into it so my heartiest congratulations to the minister sir and to the principal secretary sir for this beautifully executed initiative this Thank is the first time in india revolutionary changes in the ground level government sector schools schools in uh, india how you what the kind of I'm surprised. I myself is a government school product and uh, when I was studying in the government school, the facilities were nowhere near to it, what I'm experiencing it here right now. And it is giving me goosebumps to see that they are preparing them on the language part. And language is something which breaks the barrier. They can go to any part of the world and they can make the name of their state of India. So that is something exceptional. Otherwise, at the ground level, we really have to hard so uh, fight for this so much, and we don't get that, those kind of resources. So AP government is thinking about the resources, and they are providing and bringing the best of the resources to the students. So that is uh, thrilling, exciting. I wish that I could, you know, go back and same kind of facilities would have been given to all at every point of time. Good name, madam. Shivani Singh. Thank you. Domestic changes in education system in EAP. I actually had the privilege of working with various governments around the world and uh, being an Indian, of course, as you can see. I'm absolutely, absolutely fascinated by the stuff that Andhra government is doing, especially in terms of education. Be it school education, be it higher education. We have been to the schools and classes. I have two kids and they're going to one of the best schools in Delhi. As a parent, we are spending a fortune. And when we compare to the stuff that we pay for, we are so privileged to see that you know someone who's a commoner, someone who's studying at a government school, are able to get at least the same or probably better. I mean, they don't get the same meals and we pay a fortune. We have all the facilities, best in class content, tablets, school, books, education, world class uh, access to tools and everything, and a nutritious meal. What else one could ask for? So I'm actually surprised by the way AP is actually leading this at the forefront. And I hope other governments will take a cue from this, learn and change the overall education system in the country. Many states follow the trend of education system in our India. I don't think so. I mean, some do claim, but when you actually go there, the ground reality is very different, right? When we talk about even about the midday meal, as they mentioned that you know the you don't what do you get in seven rupees? You don't even get a boiled egg, right? Over here, when they're spending twenty one rupees, they're actually taking care of the nutritional requirements. On the other hand. What we, what we have also seen is in other schools, teachers run a parallel economy. They will lure teachers to go for private classes after schools and all. Over here, everything is available. They are focusing on TOEFL classes. No one has actually gone to that extent wherein they are imbibing TOEFL classes and the art of adaptive learning within the schools at an early age. So I think this is absolutely commendable. They are not just taking care of the current learning needs, but they are preparing students for the future. Which is which is fantastic. Your good name, sir. Amit Goyal. I head a company called edX, which is a Harvard MIT joint venture. Namaste, sir. My name is Satish Dulla. Uh, I am from Afroton International, based in Netherlands, and we are associating with SCRT and state government for the past three years in different different programs. So more or less, uh, what we have observed here, and we are really surprised and amazing to see officials and the leaders are getting into the details. They are designing each and everything. They are getting into like all the arrangements they are doing by themselves and we never saw this kind of uh, interventions in any other state because we have been associating with multiple other state governments as well. Of course there are few here and there 
few examples wherein one state might be doing one good thing and two good things but this is the state where they are completely reforming the education system by investing personally and even budget wise like there are no other words to explain as such definitely uh, i can say like uh, i'm also from andhra pradesh so i can see the difference how the education system was during my time and i just feel that i missed all this opportunity uh, so yeah these kids are very lucky to have uh, this kind of system in this particular tenure ఇంచి ఇలా ఈ మన జగన్మోహన్ రెడ్డి పెట్టినటువంటి ఎడ్యుకేషన్ సిస్టమ్ మిగతా రాష్ట్రాలు కూడా ఆదర్శంగా తీసుకుంటూ ఉన్నాయి ఎలా అనిపిస్తుంది మన రాష్ట్రం పెట్టినటువంటి ఎడ్యుకేషన్ సిస్టమ్ మిగతా చోట్ల ఇంప్లిమెంట్ చేయడానికి అవును సార్ అంతకుముందు అదే అంటున్నా మనకి ఎప్పుడైనా పలానా దగ్గర ఒక ఎగ్జాంపుల్ రెండు ఎగ్జాంపుల్ జరిగితేనే పెద్దగా గొప్పగా చెప్పుకుంటూ ఉంటారు ఇక్కడ ఇప్పుడు ఏంటంటే సింపుల్గా మొత్తం ట్రెండ్ మారింది నవ్ ఒకటి కాదు మల్టిపుల్ ఇనిషియేటివ్స్ ఉన్నాయి so that's the reason maaku uh, invite ochin tarvata we felt very lucky and we have been hearing from the other partners at least nenu aithe andhra pradesh okay but the other guests are from completely other states they can see what the difference between andhra pradesh government or andhra pradesh education system is and the other governments in the country bharatya desam nunchi un vallu participate chese sthayi ki ap vidyarthulu vellaru ante sri jagan mohan reddy janata ela anipistundi ani chustunnaru దట్స్ అదేదో అంటారు కదా సంథింగ్ వన్ టైమ్ ఆ లైఫ్ టైమ్ ఈవెంట్ టైప్ ఆ స్టూడెంట్ లైఫ్ కంప్లీట్గా మారిపోయినట్టు ఆ కాన్ఫిడెన్స్కి ఐ వుడ్ లైక్ టు కోట్ అనేది వన్ ఆర్ టూ ఎగ్జాంపుల్స్ మన గవర్నమెంట్ చేసే ఈ ఎడ్యుకేషన్ రిఫార్మ్స్ వల్ల నాట్ ఓన్లీ స్టూడెంట్స్ ఈవెన్ మన అఫీషియల్స్ లైక్ సురేష్ కుమార్ కమిషనర్ గారు రీసెంట్గా నెదర్లాండ్స్ వెళ్ళి ఒక కాన్ఫరెన్స్ అటెండ్ అయ్యారు అండ్ లాస్ట్ ఇయర్ రాజశేఖర్ సార్ టైంలో కూడా ఒక ఇండోనేషియన్ కాన్ఫరెన్స్ వల్ల ఉంది సో ఐ వాజ్ దేర్ ఇన్ దట్ కాన్ఫరెన్స్ పర్సనలీ and i could see the real recognition for our country like we were representing uh, representing our country over there not just andhra pradesh so mana reforms to see they just felt like anything they were very happy about it